Hi everybody, I'm Mike Staver. This is Money's with Mike, a weekly video series where we answer questions from people just like you. This is a good question. This answer may last a couple of days. I love this question so much. Here we go. My boyfriend, boyfriend repeats himself. My boyfriend repeats himself. My boyfriend repeats, oh, sorry. <laughs> just thought, I just thought I'd say it. I find it incredibly annoying when somebody repeats themselves. It seems like a habit. He will say something and then say the same thing again, only, only in a slightly different way. I have asked him if he thinks I can't hear <laughs> or I'm a terrible listener. He, he always says no, then proceeds to say, then he proceeds to say he just wants to make sure I understood. Other than that, we get along great. I would appreciate any tips you can share with us. <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing at this question. I, I, I'm not laughing at the question. I'm just la at laughing at the notion of your boyfriend repeating himself. So let me make sure I understand this. Like he explains to you, okay, so today at work I did A, B, and C. And then he'll say, uh, so what I'm saying is today at work I did A, B, and C. Is that, I, I'm assuming that's, you guys, that the way you hear it, that like he kind of, yeah. So uh, I think you're doing a good job. I mean, I think, I, I think that, you're doing a good job saying, hey, I, uh, I was here for the first, the first uh, enunciation of, this, of the story. I just, oh, God. Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Uh, yeah, I have a couple tips. First of all, sometimes people that repeat themselves, it is a habit. Other times it's conditioned because they came out of a background where they never really felt heard. So they develop this tendency to over explain things because they felt misunderstood a lot. So if that's the case, the biggest tip I have for you is when your boyfriend says something the first time, just acknowledge that you understand by some means other than I understand. Like this, uh, let me make sure I'm clear. And then you can just give some summary or clarifying statement about what he said so that, so that he feels comfortable that you understand. Just saying I understand probably isn't good enough. You're probably gonna have to work together to kind of say it back. So if, if he came into me and said, you know, if, if uh, they came into me and said the same thing one time, I would say, so today at work, you were in that meeting and a, you lost a contract and it didn't go so well, that must, have felt dif that must have felt difficult. So either acknowledge or ask a question that indicates that you understand. Because if you shame him about his repetitiveness, it isn't gonna say anything. If you just say, I understand, that's not gonna do anything. So if you say, okay, just so I'm clear, here's what I heard, and then either say a statement or ask a question indicating interest or indicating that you're paying attention, I think that'd be really helpful and useful. And it'll probably make you less annoyed and him less annoyed with you for telling him that you understand already and that he thinks that you can't hear. <laughs> All right. Uh, that's it for today. If you have a question for us, go to mikestaver.com forward slash monies with Mike and send us your question. If you have a question, send it. Just kidding. Take care, everybody. I'll see you next week. Bye-bye.